Right, so next video. I've stripped out like 40 mobile phones, old style ones, with the not smartphones, old style ones. Put all the socket balls on the hot sand. So, my kitchen pan. And just sit. I sat the socket balls inside there. Made it easier. These are some of the bits that fell off because of the heat. So it, shows, it kind of proves that. It does come off easier because these are the bits that just fell off. And then obviously this over here is the bits that I had and chiseled off after it was hot. It's all the loose stuff not in the jar. That's all off mobile phones. Lots of little chips like this one. Lots of little chips like that. Quite cool looking. And then obviously little sim card pins and then lots of little smaller things I can zoom in on a bit that's all of all the star on my rock buttons try to actually have them in your mouth And then yeah, second balls are gone in. <coughs> Salt, vinegar, and then peroxide again. And the bubbler. And that's Sunday evening. I want the water to go blue, not purple, like one of the experiments did. And thankfully. And this gold will be off of these socket boards. It's going to be harder than doing gold fingers because it's a lot more socket board to gold ratio. And I did fingers, it was nearly all gold, not much PCV. That makes sense. I tried to get all the stickers off, I tried to get anything, not anything other than just circuit board or gold plating. And I say, I think it's 45 mobile frames in there. So, we'll see. 